it is about nine o'clock already it has been a little bit of a slower morning it is a monday and usually i hit the ground running but i had a late night last night and um the weekend was pretty busy so i'm still doing my normal monday routine of sw um, swapping out sheets and towels to wash and we'll do a little bit of preschool here um my husband had to go into work early because quarter four is his busy season season being an e-commerce seller um so he has a lot going on so he spent a little bit more busy at work and so he left early and so i made the girls breakfast and myself a couple eggs i rewarmed my coffee um, with some heavy cream and some um, fall spices so that will be delicious here i gotta finish swapping out a few beds of the girls's and then um yeah just a day of maybe doing a little deep cleaning i haven't really officially looked through my closet for fall that might be another video um but this today is supposed to be mid 70s and then by later this week it's supposed to like snow so it's gonna change pretty quick um but right now i'm going to take a little sip of this and go work on some more bed changing go little girl worked for Naaman who was a very important man. The little girl wanted to help Naaman. He had sores all over his skin. He has the sores. Then when he get washes, he doesn't have sores. All right, so we did a little bit of preschool, had snack, and now I'm going to do some sourdough cinnamon rolls. It is that time of year where it's just a lot more fun to be baking and inside doing those cozy homemaking things. So it's just a recipe from Farmhouse on Boom. And then I might do um, some more lactation cookies actually, either now or a little bit later. But um, I've been eating those just to help increase my milk supply. So um, <laughs> all the kiddos are up and you can hear them. So. We'll see how today goes. It's been kind of one of those mornings, like I said, kind of a slow start, and then we just hit the ground running. So we're gonna keep going with the day. It's about 10 10 right now. It is time to work outside for a little while. I'm going to cut all my snapdragons down. They're still blooming, they're beautiful. It's the end of October. I don't remember flowers lasting this long where I'm at in South Dakota, so it's zone 4B. Um, so I'm gonna cut them down to like five inches and then they usually come back the next year. At least I've had pretty good fortune with that um, or pretty good luck. I don't believe in luck, but anyways, it's worked out pretty well for me to cut them back about five inches. Then I'm gonna trim back a few more flowers. We completely finished cleaning out the garden this weekend, this past weekend, so that is all done. Pulled all my tomato plants, picked all the little tomatoes we had left. I'm gonna cut some more flowers back and just probably make a few more arrangements to enjoy in the house.
Well, here's what I've collected so far. This is about it. Trimmed them all down, so I'll see if I can't put them in this vase. I did end up just tossing all my zinnias because it was time. All right, so lunch is done. Husband came home for lunch, and then I had to get the little, the <laughs> two-year-old down for a nap because it was definitely nap time. And then my little guy, five months old, he's been eating like every two hours today and not napping real well. This happened yesterday too. So either he's going through a growth spurt or I'm not sure what. So that's why I'm gonna make some lactation cookies after I work on my video here. Um, Cause I need to get that done. Cause lately I've been kind of behind. I usually like to be like a week ahead. Has not happened. So, so is life right now when we have lots of things on weekends and evenings and sometimes nap times don't always go as smooth as we all hope for, right? But that's okay. So I'm gonna work on that now and um, hopefully get that done. And Elias is just hanging out on the floor right now by me. And then I'll make some of those lactation cookies. Okay, I'm gonna work on my um, lactation cookies. They're a sugar-free lactation cookie. It calls for two bananas, but I'm gonna use one and then I have a couple of homemade applesauce, which I thought would be really good. So with the recipes, I kind of use them as guidelines, as some of you know. So I'm gonna just adjust a little bit with what I have here with some of the additions, like adding walnuts and raisins. Oh, um, maybe we'll add less because it says like a half a cup of both of those. Um, and then no chocolate chips, of course, because it's a sugar-free recipe. So I'm gonna make those up and um, maybe bake them later when I'm doing some other baking and just have them prepped in the fridge. That half gallon of yogurt or milk I used I get a quart and a half of um, Greek yogurt and then I got about one of those sizes of whey that I saved too so that'll last us about two weeks until we get our next raw milk order in yeah. Lactation cookies are made and it is so beautiful. Kids are awake. We're gonna go outside for a little stroll, play outside, and just enjoy the beauty of a wonderful fall day. Look at all the leaves. Hold the side of the bucket, there you go. Ow. So I'm gonna save Ow. these flowers and keep them inside. Um, these ones, coleus, I believe, didn't, I think they got some frost, but they'll come back and then I'm saving a geranium, some snapdragons, and then I'll see what else I wanna save out of some of these flower pots. All right, so supper tonight is just going to be like a shredded beef taco from a roast I had. I just added spices to it, and then some tortilla shells. <laughs> and I just thought I'd saute some onions and peppers in the garden to go on top of that, because I don't have lettuce. And then homemade salsa, and a vase at the table. So it's kind of run a little bit late. Had a feed Elias, we were outside. I um, haven't officially cleaned everything up outside yet, but we'll get there after supper. Um, before it rains tomorrow, I want to get all that stuff done. So I got some of the flowers repotted that I will save inside over the winter and have some
fresh flowers in um, either the basement or in my laundry area or out at my husband's work just to have some life to save for next year. So I'm gonna finish up supper so we can eat. It's about 8.15 and kids are in bed. They were bathed. Um, dishes just got cleaned up and put away. Table's pretty much set for tomorrow. I have to finish up my cinnamon rolls by rolling it out and putting in the filling. Um, but I do think my husband and I are gonna enjoy a show together. I have my tea made and replaced my flowers on my counter from my mums that were dying to the snapdragons I just cut back today. And it was a just wonderful day. It's, it was a beautiful fall day. We spent a lot of time outside, got some good yard work done before the weather changes because it's gonna start feeling more like winter, I think, than fall in a few days. But I'm going to enjoy my lemon ginger tea while I make those rolls and then I'll um, enjoy a show, clean up, and it'll be a night. So I hope you enjoy coming along today as we just did our life. So have a blessed and wonderful day.